Hey guys, so you see I've got a bit of a of an issue. I made a mistake. I should, <laughs> I guess I could crop this even more. It's already cropped technically, but I can't adjust the zoom on my webcam right now. I just made the very awful mistake of updating the, uh, updating the, the software for my Elgato face cam. And I'm sure if I reboot it or something, it would probably be fine. But here I am unable to adjust my zoom. Here, let's see. Let me edit a transform. Let's just crop. How? Oh my God. Let's get more. We're getting close though. 250 maybe? No, let's try 275. Ah. Still has that little, this little thing in the bottom corner down here. 300. All right. This will have to do. <laughs> this will have to do for now. It's a little more zoomed out than usual, but we can manage. There we go. Making it work. All right. <laughs> And hey there, Gachi Goober. Thank you so much for resubscribing for 18 months in a row. And that's right. As of today, I do have a new badge ready for the 18 monthers next month. So there, there will be a sixth Tomar Emerald to be have for those, or to be had for those who have been with us an entire year and a half. And hello to everyone out there, by the way, of course. Gachi Goober, of course. Oh yeah, and you guys, you guys have noticed you have the toe jack. That's thanks to Drawing Blood, uh, who sent over the 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 transparent PNG just today. Oh, and yeah, I threw uh, I threw I threw the ye yeek, uh, uh, the little yeek pose in there too. So yeah, we've got some new we've got some new emotes. I figured we should spice it up. But yeah, hello there, Gachi Goober. S some like it's snot. Yo, it's Caitlin, Dark Gamer. Need the milk. Ghostly Ghoul, Fluffy Dream, Narancia seven seven seven. Uh, Baffy Lamb, Manoyo82, Golden Pen HD, Dylan, Harold Krell, Old Gertie Bastard, Funke Monkey, uh, and all the friends. Arby's Gaming, there you are. I Can't Smell, Reuniclus X. Hello, hello to one and all. 357 Sneak. Oh, yeah, we have, we also have the animated No Talent. I'm glad these are these are all getting put through their paces. <laughs> I love the toe jack. <laughs> all right, so yeah, Saint Bo, it's Tomar time. Hey there, Esquire Bob, it's Tomar time. Uh, all right, so we'll we'll do a soft. Slow a little open. What I have here that was just finished in the oven is some of Mama Tomar's patented Jewish apple cake. So I'm gonna have a little bite of this while we while we sit here and get things started. My goodness. Sire 3MK. Thank you so much. 10,000 bits. Holy crap. What a way to start the stream, Sire. The sire, mm, I am at your beck and call. Yes, I'm finally able to catch a Courtney stream, says Sire. How are you, Jazzy and little Maya Tomar doing? Uh, Jazzy, I, I assume you mean Jaxie. We're doing great. I'm still upset I missed the live birthing stream. Miss you, Tommy. Oh, that's sweet, Sire. Well, thank you for coming back. And we're all doing great. Maya's the cutest little thing. Jaxie's doing much better. Still got to deal with a few little minor things, but, you know, by early November, hopefully that'll all be out of the way. Well, Maya's doing awesome. Mm, my little baby girl. Mm. Oh, this is good. 
Oh, I love Jewish apple cake. Which is not very different from German apple cake, if anyone here's ever had that. Uh, because I, my mother and my monster gift. who's Jewish, and my mother-in-law who's Austrian, both have similar and equally great recipes for apple cake. And one's the Jewish one, and one's the German one. But yeah, look at that. You see, it's got like little slivers of like uh, of apple like in the cake like apple that's been sort of soaked i know my mom one of the one of the key ingredients to the dough is orange juice it helps keep it really nice and moist mm. oh god this is good but yeah see it's got like little pieces of apple in there you see that I just want to give you guys a good view. Mm. Oh, it's good. By the way, Noble Nuggy, bless you. Thank you for the monster gift. Noble, Noble, Noble Nuggy. Thank you so much. And Tyler, thank you so much for resubscribing for 17 months, for sticking with me for these whole 17 months. Mm. Honestly, this cam proportion is pretty solid. I know, I wish I had this proportion when I was in slightly better shape, a.k.a. before I became a dad. Mm. Instead of seeing my big broad chest, you just see my big dad titties. Which I hope to reverse sometime soon. Mm. We'll get there. There's more important things than my physical health now. Golden Pen starting us off with the first shark scare. Spooky Twitch emotes? I don't know about Twitch emotes. Maybe we'll add another jump scare by the end of the month. I don't know. That's gonna... Oh. Stuff's moving. Alright. Um, Maybe we'll add another jump scare if Someone can help me come up with one, because I haven't had a whole lot of time to work on that myself. <laughs> uh, let's see. Sire, thank you for resubscribing for seven months. I feel like this seven months is cheating since I missed the last two months of streams. Lol, but I'm back. But I'm so glad I'm back. I'm glad you're back, Sire. We missed you. There was a there was a sire shaped gap in our lives. And Dylan, thank you for the sub to Reuniclus. Uh, Dylan always a, a giant sweetheart. And then failed heart Andy, thank you for the ten months of 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 a subscription in or sorry, thank you for spending ten months in the subscriber verse. Uh, I'm coding HTML CSS, but at least I got some Tomar stream to keep me sane. Only HTML and CSS, so you've got form, you've got style, but where's your function? Where's your JS? You need some JS. Learn a front end, learn some Angular, learn some React. Get on top of it, man. At least learn some damn jQuery. No, you're, I'm sure you're doing fine, and there's probably somebody else doing all that. Harold Krell saying learn PHP. That's honestly like that's back end server stuff. PHP, I feel like it's it's popular because it's been popular, but it seems like everyone's going over toward Node. And of course, I'm still in the Python camp. And you know, we're not we're not small. We're not so small as Python people. But a lot of stuff is is JavaScript and Node on the back end even now. So it's like if you're already a web dev and you already learn JavaScript for the front end, you might as well just go to Node, I guess, and you don't have to pick up another language. I feel like that's the reason. Why, uh, why all these, what, why Node even got as big as it did in the first place? 
what do i know ryogu thank you for subscribing resubscribing for 17 months in the subscriber verse and candy cane 39 has spent 15 months in the subscriber verse and estes soup thank you as well for resubscribing for 15 months in the subscriber verse all right i gotta calm down uh tomorrow i got called uh i got called Delicious the other day. What's the proper response to that? I don't know. Uh, do Jewish people actually dislike goys? Asks Froggy Pond videos. I don't think I can speak for all Jewish people, but I mean that does that would not apply for me. Most of my friends are non-Jewish people. Uh, but I was inundated with Jewish people for my entire life, so maybe that's just got that's just says something about me. I, I wanted to go another way. And I have nothing against Jewish people, mind you, but I just didn't let people's religion dictate uh, who I was going to be friends with and how I was going to lead my life, I guess. Uh, Sire3MK, thank you for the 100 bits. Thanks for keeping Courtney Mar around. Oh, of course, Sire. I, we've been keeping her warm for you. I, don't, I don't think that that came off the wrong way. You know, keep it, you know, like she's been in the freezer, but the opposite of that, whatever. And <laughs> Uncle Chris TV, uh, thank you for resubscribing for a whole year now. That's your fifth Tomar Emerald, Uncle Chris TV. And like I said, the sixth Emerald is now officially what's going to show up. See, if I talk right now, I think, I, no, even I wouldn't have a sixth Tomar Emerald because we, I don't think we've existed for, uh, for what's it called? Here, testing. Do I? Yeah, even I only have the five the five month uh, icon. We have to have existed for for a year and a half before I think anybody gets that. Uh, old Gertie Bastard, thank you for the hundred bits. Show us your cake. I my cake is is now. Oops. Well, that made a mess. Uh, my cake is mostly gone. It was eaten, except for those crumbs that all just spilled off my plate directly onto my keyboard and the area around it that I'm now, and, and my phone, and just about everything on my desktop, really. That was stupid. <laughs> uh, that one wasn't Jack. Jaxie didn't make that cake. That one my mom made. She's in town helping out with the baby which I always appreciate. Uh, Sire, thank you for the gifted sub to Nightbot for whatever reason. I guess that was, was that a random gift that it just happened to go to Nightbot? What a, what a silly thing to happen. Nightbots don't need subs. Ginger Lion 32 thank you for resubscribing for seven months. Ginger Lion says, yeehaw, another month of Tomar. And Java Moss Boss has also spent seven entire months in... You guessed it, the subscriber verse. I should have said you guessed it without the filter. I ruined the effect. Jesus Christ, gotcha, goober. I'm going to turn my sound up even more, though. That one did not scare me, and I'm disappointed it didn't scare me. I want to make sure the next one really does. So we're going to turn volume up from a few different places just to be sure of that. By the way, uh, to those of you, <laughs> I just realized we're playing an ad. No right talent! Now. Jesus. Mediocre piece of shit! Okay, that one worked. That was definitely loud enough. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, Sire, thank you for the 707 bits. I'll gift Nightbot if I want to gift Nightbot Daddy Tomar TM. I am the real Daddy Tomar now that you're back, Sire. I'm the real deal. I am both a Tomar and a true daddy. By the way, I got a nice, a, a brilliant little addition to my desk here. So not only do I have this cool new microphone arm. Uh, here, yeah, let's ruin the... I got my Dr. Pepper here, but it was just over here. And my cool... I have a little cup holder which itself houses, this is attached to a little headphone hook. So I could put my headphones down here. I just thought you guys would wanna know. It just seemed important. And I still have my old Loot Crate mouse pad from 
God knows when. Now I gotta find that sweet spot again. Here. Oh. All that cropping and you now stop trying to scare me. Stop trying to scare me. All right. I think, yeah, that'll do. We're not, do we have any other like leaking spots on the green screen? I don't think so. All right, here we go. Uh, that mouse pad has so much sweat. I mean, probably Uncle Chris TV. This is, I've had this way too long. It's curling at the edges. It definitely ought to be replaced. Uh, and thank you, by the way, Super Jenks, for scaring me. And Fronald420, thank you for resubscribing for seven months. Uh, hey, Tomar, your classic Tomar line, you guys are the spitting image of two worms at war, has been stuck in my head. I don't know why it's so funny to me, but I love it. Did I really, is that really a classic Tomar line, or are you gaslighting me? I don't even remember saying that. You guys are the spitting image of two worms at war. I, I, <laughs> what, did I, I really, really said that, huh? Okay. Everybody say it, I said it. Okay. Well, you guys wouldn't all gaslight me, would you? I hope not. Chewbuck96, thank you for resubscribing 17 entire months. But yeah, I'm going to take the Dr. Pepper out of my patented Tomar cup holder. And... See how much sturdier this is? Remember I used to have that issue where this was always like drooping down? I love my new mic arm so much better. It actually holds the microphone where I put it. There's no balancing act. Uh, and Chewbox says, 17 months. I've been busy and haven't been able to catch as many streams, unfortunately. Hey, no worries. You've, you've remained a subscriber, and I always appreciate when you drop in, Chewbox, and I hope med school's been going well for you. Sire. Uh, thank you for the dime. Heck yeah, Nightbot with those two Tomar Emeralds. Yeah, Nightbot has two Tomar Emeralds? So this isn't even the first time Nightbot's been... This is the third time, at least, that Nightbot has been has been crowned a <laughs> Yeah, no, turning the volume up was a great choice. Hey, Golden Pen, thanks for the 111 bits. I got an idea for a scare. It's just an actual gunshot that is 140 decibels loud. We have to donate... Uh, one, 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 one bits for it. You know what? I'm open to that. If, if, I, if I make $111 every time somebody, uh, reduces my hearing capacity by, by 0.1 decibels, it'll, it'll take, I'll, I'll make a few thousand bucks before I lose my hearing at that rate. Uh, let's see. And the animated no talent. I can't. I I, I want to credit that one to to F Kim. I'm pretty sure F Kim made that for me. But please, someone please correct me if I'm wrong. With the the the, the animated no talent, I'm, I'm like ninety percent sure that would have been F Kim that that did that. And Seth Lana, thank you for resubscribing with Prime. No, not resubscribing. New subscribing. Thank you, Seth Lana, for. Being a new subscriber and joining us here at the subscriber first. That did scare me. I did not see that coming. Uh, big bouncing bogus. You got me. Uh, good evening, Tomar. Hope your evening is going well. Oh, it is drawing blood. Oh, it so is. Let's see. Uh, when Tomar strays away from the teleprompter. <laughs> All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Uh, it's time for Tomart. Uh, I just got an interesting text from someone who wants me to help them with Python. Oh, that's exciting. No one ever asked for my help with Python. But I bet I could do it. Let's see. And da, 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 da. before I get too distracted, uh, 
let's let's get Tomart all ready to go. Window capture. Freaking Tomart. Well. Oh, there it is. We got our window capture working. Here's our first tome art, which is really so much art uh, as it is a meme. Uh, but this is from Alistor 4060945 or AKA Mr. No talent, mediocre piece of shit. Christ, super jank. All right, you got me. You got me again. Breed of evil. That is, I, because it's 777, I didn't make that one of the most like, la I think I put intentional distortion on that one. So it would be especially jarring. But Breed of Evil, thank you. Another new member of the subscriber first. So thank you for joining us, Breed of Evil. Thank you, Super Jank, for that terrifying 777 bits. Okay, so this one's Mr. Art. I told you, we are going to watch Tomart, and then you can leave. So that's a, that's a reference to uh, uh, that guy, that serial killer guy. And this one is from Drawing Blood. Uh... Spooky October Tomart. It looks like Tomar may have drawn the ire of a vengeful witch. Uh, Jaxie, I think I may have drawn the ire of a vengeful witch. I think I may have been cursed or something. <laughs> so that's, that's a little, we got a little Tomar jack-o'-lantern going on here. Very cute. Very good stuff. Uh, all right, all right. Before we get to the end of all this, uh, and we shouldn't have any more ads, by the way, for according to my numbers, another 19 minutes. So thank you for that drawing blood. Very lovely. Now we have a, a special video presentation hey, yeah. from FCAM, 52 seconds long. Here we go. Hey guys, it's your good friend Boney Tomy here with some not so surprising news. I'm gonna go kiss my beautiful wife and then go outside to terrorize the local children. They've gotten far too loud lately and need to be put in their place. See you guys October 19th. The classic record scratch by F. Kim. All right, kiddos. I guess I'll uh, rev up my chainsaw and get you all the pain and fear. Is that it? No. The audio was taken from the latest Boney Plays video, just in case if Tomar asked me where I got it. Yeah, you Tomar. Hey, you got the thing to line up. Hey, it was really yeah. pointing at me. It was really pointing at me, you guys. It was me. Uh, all right. Thank you for that, F. Kim. I appreciate the, the, the Chainsaw Man references. I still haven't gotten a chance to watch it. I promised Adam from Oni Plays... Uh, that we'd watch it together and we just haven't had made a time yet, but I'm going to hopefully we'll watch it like this weekend before I go back to work. Cause my family paid leaves about up and I got to go back to work like a big boy. Uh, let's see. Sire. Thank you for the hundred bits. Tomar, you better have been wearing the Tomar Tomar top hat these past two months. I have. Ask anyone in the room. I have. I've been pretty good about it. Uh, Eddie Valentine 2. Thank you for resubscribing for seven months. Tomar, I hate when people gaslight you. It's been a great eight months. Hey, now. Hey, now, Eddie. Hey, now. Eight's one more than seven, last I checked. Sire, thank you for the 100 bits, by the way. October 19th. Oh, that's tomorrow. Is my birthday. Uh, which is when Boney Plays begins, which is also coincidentally Tomar's birthday. No, it is. <laughs> it is not that. Oh, this stupid hat will never stay on. <clears throat> there. Let me crush this very well made leather hat onto my very cheaply made uh, fitted cap. Let's see, which is also coincidentally Tomar's birthday. Not true. So happy early birthday to us, Tomar. Well, happy birthday to Sire. Everybody wish Sire a happy birthday. And uh, I should stop making so much damn noise because my little daughter's asleep in the other room. But you get the idea. Woon. Uh, thank you for resubscribing for five months. Rocking that TF2 look. Oh, yeah, the hat on a hat on a hat on a hat on a hat. That's me. 
And then, uh, th but thank you for resubscribe for, for 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 resubscribing for five months. And Dylan, I'm not getting that. Dylan, thank you for gifting a sub to Liv Hardman. I'm so sick of this thing coming off. <laughs> Big bouncing bongus with the with the shark jump scare. I swear, if I destroy this hat, I'll I, like I'll be happy because I'll have an excuse to stop wearing it. Uh, oh shoot, this one's cool, Baffy Lamb. The ultimate in alien terror, the Tomar. Is this based on this? This is so familiar. Is this the thing? Is this a reference to the thing, the 1980s film horror film? Or or am I am, am I missing the reference? Is it another movie? Okay, Baffy Lab confirms it's the thing. Awesome. I really like this. Very cool. The ultimate in alien terror. The Tomar. Hold on. The ultimate in alien terror. Alright, I just wanted to see how it would sound. This one, by our very own Golden Pen HD. Hey, Jaxie, I turned into a horrible monster. Can't wait to see more amnesia gameplay from Tomar. Is, is this a spoiler? Does, is that a... I'm not even gonna... I don't even... If it is a spoiler, I don't even want to know. Because I really have never played Amnesia before. This has all been a blind playthrough for me so far. And Tyler, thank you so much for the gift sub to Die Hardman. And T Ty Danny TV, thank you for resubscribing for two months. And uh, I'm glad you love the hat. Uh, it's good stuff. All right, this next one, another another Florgan contribution. Tomar using his magic powers on a businessman. Yeah, that's pretty much how it would go down. I'd look like that. I'd have that chin. I'd make his pupils leave. And he did do the little the little jazz hands down here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All checks out. Uh, and then Evkim, Evkim snuck in another last minute one. Tomar in <laughs> so Tomar in Anya mood only on Tomar. Oh look, F Kim is spamming emote. <laughs> One week watching Spy X Family. I do love when she makes that face though. The little like she makes it in the in the in the the closing credits where she looks at the camera and goes, "Well, it's the exact same thing F Kim used in his video, but it is a really cute little." Little little impish face. Like I said, I'm like a sucker for everything about like little children right now. It it warms my heart as a new father. Yeah, I'm I am gonna teach my daughter how to make that exact face, not Lavare. Oh, F Kim made a chainsaw mar? Oh I like that. Oh I like that. Yeah. Pass that one over. Pretty please with sugar on top. Oh, F. Kim, you have the nicest things. Uh, all right. That is so cute. I do love that. I might make this my... F. Kim, I might make this my icon uh, once Octomar's over. Like my Twitter icon. Because I really like this. Anyway. Uh, let's be done with Tomart then. And we can just jump straight into some... We should go into Amnesia, Amnesia, The Dark Descent, a.k.a. Amnesia.exe. And also, uh, oh wait, Sire just gave me 10 cents and requested that I halt the stream so he can pee pee. I won't do exactly that, but here's what I will do. Keep playing, but it's all right. The next ad, by the way, is in 11 minutes, 11 seconds. Uh, and finally, Irradiated Grape, thank you for the $3 tip. Zoo wee mama, big fan of the big T. That's, those are Irradiated Grape's words. All right, we're jumping right back in. 
Sato Masks. Thank you for subscribing. We got a new subscriber, Sato Masks. Or Sato Masks. Who's doing the subscriber verse? Now, last time I played this, I put a slight, just a slight little reverb on my voice. Just so it feels more like we're here in this building. I feel like it adds to the experience. Thanks for that, Super Jack. GL, have fun. I have to bounce. Well, I'm glad you got one last scare in before you you go, Super Jank. Uh, so yeah, I don't know what to do next. <laughs> Big bouncing bug is thank you as well. All right, so I just got back to this room and it's all goopy doing that, which I don't think is a good sign. But we have, let's see, we have, we have a crowbar, we have a steam rod, we have a flow cycle rod, we have a hand drill, we have a four phase amplitude rod, we have a hollow needle, and a uh, slight headache and a few cuts and bruises. So we're hanging in there. And we have 14 tinder boxes. So, would it be a mistake to go down here? Like, where we really need to try to get to next, I think, is the machine room. So that we can use all these cool, like, levers we've collected. Is it? This isn't a pickable lock, is it? No. We can't pry it open with no crowbar, and this elevator is definitely stuck. So we need to, need to find the key to that. I don't know if there's some other place I can go back to that maybe will let me use the uh, the crowbar or the or the acid. Actually, do we even still have the acid? Oh yeah, we can get rid of this. I'm done steampunking it out here. By the way, not Lavare or not Lavar, thank you for resubscribing for six months. Uh, you've earned your third Tomar Emerald. Tomar is loving the steampunk environment. He's clapping his feet together. How'd you know? Marshall Media Official. Hold on a sec. Uh, because I don't know if he's going crazy. No, you know what? There's light in here. We're not going too wacky yet. Though it is awfully noisy. Um, it's a little creepy in here. Marshall Media, thank you for the 1099 tip. Hey, Tommy, here's some snack money. Quick question. How many of your friends have you converted to the Church of One Piece? I mean, it's some. I, I don't know if I give a finite number. I've convinced at least, I want to say, like three or four other people to really put in the work for One Piece. Like, most of them are people who have seen a little bit and I convinced them to try again, get back into it. Uh, but probably only just a small handful, if I'm being honest. Windex and Whiskey, thank you for resubscribing for 16 months. Ah, he wish misses the dapper hat already. I like, I think this is a better look. I think one hat is a good amount of hats. I'm gonna look through this area to see if there's anything we can open up. Blast you, book! Blast! We have a working lantern. Just wanted you guys to know. But it sounds awfully blustery outside. No talent! Mediocre piece of shit! Fucking <laughs> Christ. Oh, congrats on being a new father. Good luck to you and Jaxie. Thank you, Rune. I must have been in here already. Oh my goodness. Yeah, no crowbars helping me out here. We got lights, we got lights, we got lights. And we've been out here. Oh, there was an oil. Okay. 
Have we been in here before? There's a cool hammer. What? Chambers of the human skull. Milestones of human anatomy. Understanding balance. The canine jaw. Oh, goodness. That's right. There's some crazy person here who, like, tortures dogs. I don't care for that person. Not one bit. Uh, they're not so nice to birds either. That wasn't to desecrate the bird's corpse. That was just to set him free. Sorry, Mr. Bunny. Be free, you all. Oh, God. I don't want to pick that up. Uh, let's just, let's just hide that. That's, that's not good for our soul. Uh, oh god. Yeah, I saw that statue through there for a second. It freaked me out for just a second. Just a sec. Have I been in here? I don't remember being in here earlier. Cover your shame, man. Let's see. There's a nice little ink blotter. Thank you for the hundred bits, sire. Tomoto's got to add the me, 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 me sound he made during that real horror stories game. He played with Chris and Zach as a jump scare. I'd give ten bits for that. I don't actually know what sound you're talking about. Me, 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 me. Oh. Oh, and I just go me 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 me. Now I know what you're talking about. I don't know if that would make a good jump scare. Was it more high pitched? Me 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 me. Was it more like that? I'm try like I'm trying to remember. Yeah, get down off that wall. Blast you. Blah. Bold a dashing foolish, shouted Cyrus, as he continued building Castle McDuck. Uh. Well, three time, Tiger. I bet you're proud of yourself for scaring me. Why is Tomar so good at telling dad jokes? Because he comes from a long line of dads. Yeah, who would have thunk? Uh, thank you for the bits three time, Tyler, even if they were to terrify me. So yeah, and then over here, just doesn't go anywhere. So if we were to go back here, which I feel like I will regret... Is there anything else that we've, like, missed? We've definitely touched this thing. When will it be my turn? Yeah, I don't know. Chamber controller. Emergency decelerator. We're in a bit of a dark place. Yeah, like, I know we've been here, and yeah, and then this caved in. Let's not get all amnesia on. What? It's so cold. What, what do you mean it's so cold? Says who? Is, is that normal? For him to say that? I hope I don't need this gear. I hope this isn't a critical game item. So now it's really far down there. Don't misstep. Don't misstep. Alright, so this backtracking proved pretty much fruitless. Time to do more backtracking. Let's get it on. Let's get it done.
You say try next area, Skelter Helter, but I don't know what what you mean by next area. Oh, it's all foreboding in here. I think we've been to the guest room too. Put some oil in me lamp. Let's climb through the goop. I feel like we don't have the key for this. Archive tunnels are totally closed. I don't want to go near that one. That'll hurt me, I'm pretty sure. So yeah, we have we can't get anything in there yet. You came from archive tunnels. It's closed forever. Okay, that's all well and good. Oh, oh man, that thing's that thing spat at me. It chewed on me a little bit. I have a few cuts and bruises, though. It's all right. And then down here was uh, a place I really didn't want to return to. Storage. But maybe I'm supposed to? Oh, I missed something in guest room? Okay, I'm going to go back to guest room. I don't want to be in here. We got this, you guys. Okay. Back to the old guest room. And you guys are talking about Arduinos or something in chat. It's a, it's a hobbyist kit for making basic... It's, a, it's like an electronics controller that you can program with a C-like language. The door is stuck due to a broken lock. Oh my god, what if I were to use this? Oh, really? Okay. There's some oil that I managed to miss. Surely that's not the thing. That was it, wasn't it? I forgot to throw that ink. Hiya! Alright, nothing cool in there. Ding dang diddly thing did I miss here? By the way, I'm probably gonna have to take a bathroom break in the next like minute. I suddenly have to go very badly. So that's just that just is what it is. Oh thank you, Dylan, for gifting a sub to Arby's Gaming. Searching more drawers. But you know what? We could try the crowbar on that stuck door. Let's try that. If this crowbar works. Oh ho. Please let it be here. All right. So with that, with that little bit of progress, I'm going to go into toilet mode. So thank you guys and hang tight. I'll be right back in a couple minutes. Okay.
We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. Okay. Yeah, I washed my hands, F. Kim. I, I kind of do that. My hands smell like lavender. Hmm. All right. That went well. I feel much better. I feel a pound lighter. And now we can uh, re enter the dark descent. I think. There we go. Let's just... How many times do you wipe? I don't have to answer that. Oh, wait. What did I... Oh, Sire, thank you for the 100 bits. Uh, wow, you're going to halt the stream for your pee-pee break, but not for me. Oh, that wasn't just a pee-pee break, if you hadn't guessed by now. We share birthdays tomorrow. <laughs> Come on. Well, I hope you have a very happy one tomorrow, Sire. Despite all your gaslighting. And Sire, also thank you for the dime. 4th of July, 1839. Tomar, you done. left your mic on. We heard the every moan. I did not leave it on. I was awakened by an exhausting I nightmare. I did not. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them. But somehow, I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. With no the adhesive. The ancient stone relic oh. now rests There's on more. my table. That was it's my greatest jump scare of all. And perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. Okay. Did I seem impatient there? I totally wanted to listen to what the British guy had to say, I swear. I really want to get that shirt. Why can't I have nice things? There. Eh, I don't want an intro. all. Oh no! The door closed! It's locked! Alright, it's not locked. What? What? Are you fucking kidding me? It won't! It won't pull! Fuck! What's going on? Can I have this on in here? Is that okay? So I don't go mad. Oh god. This sounds really close. This sounds really dang close. Is that it leaving or coming? I don't know. blood jesus christ you got me you got me good <laughs> oh my god quite the little mess we've got here but i didn't find a key this was clearly some important part of the game there's just like a little hanger there oh boy was that a genuine shriek gachi goober ass oh that was genuine look I never said I was unscarable I've never make such a bold claim. Just to warm the place up a bit, you know. Something tore this plate a place apart. I mean, besides just me. Maybe, maybe not besides just me. It's bloody stuck. It's bloody stuck it is. Well, 
This rabbit, I never really liked anyway. All this can feed the flames burning within my heart. Oh cool, a figurine. That's exactly where I wanted it. Uh where oh where has my little key gone? There was so much implication of a key being in here. So how could it not be? This wasn't all for nothing, was it? Do you like paintings, Tomar? Was that is that a clue, Skelter? Is there something special about this here painting? I really wish I could see the other side of it. These damn hissing cockroaches. There we go. Well, cool. I got to see it. Nothing in that painting. There are many paintings. So there are. Oh. oh! Thank God, there it is. I guess it is a good place to hide it then. Oh, cool! I finally have an excuse to throw a bottle. Yes! Picked up the machine room key. Everything's looking just plain and normal out here. Never mind that human chest. At least the goo hasn't moved. I hope there's no dastardly demons in the machine room. Thank you, sire, for the 1,000 bits. Tomar, there was a time when you were playing Kingdom Hearts and your mom... Oh, Tomar, was there a time when you were playing Kingdom Hearts and your mom was in the shower and you really had to poop, but you didn't want to poop while your mom was in the shower and you just kept waiting and holding in the poop playing Kingdom Hearts, but then you just couldn't hold it in anymore and you pooped yourself and ruined the chair you were sitting in. Just curious. Nope. That sounds like it's too specific not to be somebody's real story, though. That ain't me. That ain't me, sire. That just ain't me. Eddie, you're gonna mute me and watch the new Hellraiser movie? Okay. That's really what what you want to do. I guess I can't stop you. Chimpy fella, thanks for the 100 bits, by the way. You should slip a worm into Zach's pocket next Let's Play besides that... Uh, keep on being the omnipotent being you are, you blessed man. Thank you, Chimpy. And uh, Debt Left the Ward, the sorry, Debt Left the Dwarf, which I should recognize by now that it's been 16 months. Thank you for resubscribing for 16 months. Uh, and Debt Left says, Boo! What's one piece of VA advice you'd give yourself when you were starting out? Uh, trust all your instincts. You'll You'll be fine. I don't know. I don't feel like I have any regrets as far as my VA career has gone thus far. Uh, so I don't know that I... I feel like... Uh, like I just tell myself to go for it. Do the do what, you, do what you're going to do. I, got, I, I know that's a little cheesy, but I, I really can't think of anything that, that would have like, you know, that I feel like I really missed out on. That I didn't eventually come to learn the the proper way 
Joshua suck my crucifix Tomar. Yes, big bouncing bug is that his eye. Okay, why am I getting all woozy in here? There's clearly functioning lights. Anything over here that's manipulatable? It can be pawn pond for my chess. 5th of July, 1839. Today, I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful, and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting I like talking about my the orbs. Prevalent trace they I simply in don't, culture. can't go anywhere without the my orbs. The mythic orbs may, in fact, have inspired the Globus Cruciger which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. Thank so you, sire, for the 1,000 bits. Yay, it's our so birthday, Tomar. Happy birthday, Tomar. Birthday, Tomar. Oh, on the East Coast, it is now the 19th. Happy birthday, sire. His expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. I can't help feeling responsible somehow. Ooh, this looks important. Uh, surely nothing bad will happen if I just start pressing levers at random. Uh, three's bigger than one. Five's bigger than three. Six is bigger than five. Five's bigger than one. Two, who cares? Four's bigger than two. Puzzle solved. We're done. Uh, yep. And that made those two tinder boxes appear, of course. Naturally. That's how these games work. Trust me on this, guys. Alright. Wait, do I have any cool insights? Okay. So we have our journal mementos. Let's see. Find a way to start the engine that powers the elevator. I mean, that's... I get it. That's our goal here. I'm just going to do a little bit more walking around. Let's try this door. Seems like another good place to light a torch. There's another. All right, we've got our trick, trick, flow. It means flow. Okay, machine equipment memo. Note that there are only two spare rods left in storage for the elevator machinery. Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged. Keep the others in the inner study rooms in case all three would crack again. 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers. Today, okay. I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect <laughs> Oh, you didn't like I that drawing blood, did you? I it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. <laughs> Jesus. I shall visit my physician, Thanks for Dr. That big Ted, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Okay, so 
Let me have a look at these rods. <laughs> Excuse me. Gracious. <laughs> Machine equipment memo. Two spare rods left in storage. Is there a way to tell which rod would go in which flow cycle? Four phase amplitude and trinity. Okay. So I'm guessing that's in the three sided shape. The four phase goes in there, and the flow cycle goes in there. Aha! All rods are in place. That's using the old noodle. Now God knows what comes next. That definitely seems like part of the puzzle. The fry angle goes with the fry angle, Tommy. Seventeenth of July, eighteen thirty-nine. How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their skin flayed as if boiled. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith, Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. I have no choice but to trust the Baron. He better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. That sounded like a threat. This seems kind of important. Let's light some of these. What does this lever do? Oh, nothing in the burner for it to ignite. Can I throw... Oh, whoops. I guess that just goes right in my lantern. So, there's stuff that we can burn. Missing cogwheels. Okay, so this... This turns on the machine, but probably not going to be useful till I find these three missing cogwheels. Does this count? This cogwheel does not fit on this spoke. Alright, there we go. One missing cog wheel. Ah, ah, ah. More than half. I might as well fill up what I've got. All right, we're digging for cog wheels. I'm not good at digging in this game. Oh, God. There's just not too much here, if you catch my drift. How many cogwheels are just hidden behind miscellaneous boxes? Cogs will cogs! What'll I ever do about cogs will cogs? That's my that's my George Jetson. But Lois, what'll we do about cogs will cogs? <laughs> All right. Ooh, look! I found another one. There we go. Just need one more of them. Lois, we better find the missing cags. 
Jane stop this crazy cocks? Ooh, I found it. Ooh, ooh. We, that's my Elroy Jetson. This is wasting the time I misplaced my cags. Ooh. Ah. Well, what does it need now? Is it whatever goes in here? Well, clearly we have all the cogs. I don't know what these cogs are connecting to, unless there's something very special behind this shaft that that cog needs to turn. But I would guess that it's got something to do with this little number. But what can we even fit in there, huh? That's the real question. And this is nothing I can interact with, right? You can't mess with these at all anymore. Well, the important thing is we've got our pressure. Thank you, three-time tiger, by the way, for the spook earlier. Even though I apparently whizzed right over my head. And chimpy fella, thank you for the hundred bits. Don't lie, you're hiding your precious emerald behind them. Oh no, not the back hall! I didn't mean to go in there. What are we gonna do about kags? Well, kags! This is like that time the poor second patriots went to kags well and took all his kags. I need to, I need to stop. All right. Could it be something to do with this crafty little puzzle? Let's burn this. It won't let me. All right. Is there some hint? Yeah, no crap find a way. I feel like I'm missing something very important. Elevator machine instructions. Okay, Trinity. Four phase amplitude, steam cycle flow. The meter should read, oh, up eight, down eight. There we go. Okay. So we need the total. So this is currently at four plus three, seven, eight, nine. Uh, way too much down here. So we got an up eight, but then we have like a down, like way too much. Here, let's move this here. So now we have on the top, we have uh, five. On the bottom, we have uh, like 11, 12, uh, 14. Let's see, this is six, seven, eight. Oh, there we go. That did it. The flow is even and stable. All right. Now let's try pulling this lever and see what happens. Ooh, damn it. All right, what do I need for this blursted thing? Let's look back at our notes, I guess. All right, elevator breaks down again. Make sure to use the steam engine to build up pressure before channeling it into the machinery. Adjust the letters left to right. Make sure 
The flow is set according to the following chart. Trinity Steam set functions four phase amplitude complete steam flow cycle. Note that the machine will not check proper configuration until all rods are inserted. Let's go check those rods again in case I just guessed wrong. Even though it sure seems like I did this right. What with this room being fill, full of steam valve. S steam. The black thing beside me is coal? Wait, what black thing? Am I missing something? Oh, oh, oh. Well, oh gosh. Look at that. <laughs> Don't I feel silly? All right, the burner needs more coal. Oh, sorry burner. Well, I got all the coal you need right here. The burner is now full of coal. All right. Jesus. Okay. W World, first of all, thank you for resubscribing for two months. Tomar, your hat is looking especially purple today. Keep up the good work. Thank you, w -w -w World. And Super Jank, thank you for trying to scare me to death. Now I'm pulling this. Ooh. We made something happen. I think we might have fixed the elevator. Where's all this meat coming ah, Jesus! Where's all this dang meat coming from? Oh, come on! It's just appearing everywhere. Oh. oh, this is the worst. He flipped through the Book of Monarchs, looking for etchings and counted nine different kings from all over Europe. Something, something. What the? Oh, so much damn meat. I can't take all this meat anymore. Ooh. So William Smith had been marked. There was no way for him to know what the young man from the other day cast such a horrible shadow. How is our brain doing? Okay, we're doing all right. Oh, come on. Thomas VX for subscribing with Prime, I guess. That's what the noise I would make if I just fell down an elevator shaft. Come this way. What was that? Forgive me. What I was that? Warned you. One of my responsibilities as a baron is that of a prison warden. This is where criminals are locked up. Like a dungeon? Very much so. Come, don't linger. Hey. I gotta use all my muscles. There we go. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Woo! Is that blood? I say, I say, is that blood I see?
All right. Someone's having a bad time in here. Oh. Oh, are you... What is going on? What is going on? This is a little unsettling, believe it or not. Oh, is this a freaking maze? Lois, who put the freaking maze here? Oh, no, oh, no, we can't make a little infinity clinking machine. No, oh, they won't hit each other. Oh, this is very sad. <laughs> okay. I need to stop. Oh, don't do that. Don't come this way. Oh dear. Oh my. Oh bother. here by the candle and hope he's not coming oh my god why he got to do that thing he do by the way thank you super dm bro for resubscribing for 13 months tomar is this a tour of your house simulator uh huh and great saiyajin man thank you for resubscribing for eight months Happy Spooktober. Sorry, Spook Yober. Will you please make a meme out of barrels? I don't know what that means. I'll throw a brick. gonna stand by my candle my brain is a little dot 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 right now good things please stop warping pretty plaques you know what I'm just gonna push through the insanity Wound. Oh, uh, yeah, you got me. He was hanging around here. Don't just yell at me. <sighs> All right. Sally forth. Oh, and our oil ran out of, our lantern ran out of oil. Oh, we don't want to look at that. Can't Daniel just come to terms with the fact that there's spooky stuff here and stop going insane every time he has to think about it? But mother, I don't want to leave without you. Hurry, child. You must 
go. Find Gabriel, the Outrider, and tell him to alert the King's men. No, you come too. Please, we don't have time to make the hole any wider. Oh, you don't but... say. Someone is coming. Hurry, I'll cover the hole with the bed. Everything will be fine. I promise you. I figured that out before she talked about the bed. Guess that makes me some kind of savant. Uh, I don't like that sound though. I better run away. Too narrow. Oh, can I use the hammer on it? Oh, are you kidding me? I need another tool besides the hammer. Oh, I suppose some sort of chisel. Oh, come on. Don't no. You can't open doors, can you? Ugh. All right, sire. I'll try with this dime not to get scared before you get back. Where's this other dang thing I'm looking for now? Oh, the lock's corroded and weak. And yet I can't use the hollow needle to pick it. Oh, wait. We can't hammer it. And we're out of a whale again. Just making things worse. Look, this is no place for a young girl all by herself. She could be hurt or worse. There's no telling what horrors await down there. I have some idea of the horrors that await. Ooh! A chipper! AKA a chisel. Almost all lantern oil. Alright, I think I got all the stuff I need. Woo! Off I go to the northern block. Sire, how dare you? How dare you try to scare me? I bet you have a pocket full of dimes by now. You know it. Wait, a branching path? Blast! Do I have any... What else do I have to go on, by the way? No mementos. Right. Good old trusty right. Never led me astray, right? Ah, dang it. Oh, there we go. Just a few bits of rubble to clear. Let's see. This way to storage. I don't want to go back to storage. And this way to kitchen. Well, that sounds better. Gate is locked and the padlock is in excellent condition. Won't budge. Do I still? Okay, cool. I do have my hammer and chipper. Yeah. 
Got some oil. 2nd of August, 1839. I have arrived We're making our way through. It's a haven in the midst of a vast forest and the last stop before my final destination, Castle Brennenburg. It's late in the evening, and the outrider, who has been with the coach since Bremen, advised me to wait until morning before I venture further. I've arranged for a bed at Der Müller, the village's only inn, and am now waiting for the sun to rise. I try Excuse to sleep, me. but as I close my eyes, I see the men who fell victim in London. My fear and shame forces me to witness the same scenes over and over. They are dead because of me. Ah, oh, why would you go and do a thing like that? This is a lovely kitchen, by the way. Really like the open concept. Hold on. Little 9.30 alarm, never hurt nobody. Hey, barrel! Woo! Alright. Nothing behind those barrels. What a disappointment. This is a poorly stocked kitchen. Ooh, tinder. Tinder. Swing them piggies, swing them good, swing them up high and swing them with wood. Oh god, it's some sort of acid. Do I have a container to fill with said acid? A wound is bleeding quite badly. Ho <laughs> ho, but not anymore. My magic ointment saved the day. And I replaced it immediately with another. Oh, I was really hoping I could use that to knock over all the other barrels. There we go. The bottleneck is too narrow for the flask to be filled without spilling the acid. But a glass container is an ideal vessel. You don't say. What are you trying to tell me? Ah, I touched the damn acid again. All is good, though. Worry not, all is good. Thank you, sire, for the gifted sub to Average Cornbread. And thank you, Average Cornbread, for coming and giving us a little raid. It keeps trying to push that bottle I dropped in out, but... Look at that! Ah, I touched the, touched the damn acid again. I'm not trying that again. Three time tiger! Three time tiger! This game does have. Oh god. It finally gave up the thing. This does have excellent pig physics. Whoa! Did you guys see that? That's some of the best pig physics I ever seen. <laughs> All right, so we need a good wide mouth glass container and some moldy bread. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Theo, why doesn't this container break? Oh well. It's clearly something else. I've been wasting a lot of my lantern. Aren't there any, like, hanging lights back here? I guess not. That's kind of pointless with the fire there, but... I guess we have to go back towards storage. Oh, come on! Who invited that guy? Don't keep coming, don't keep coming, don't keep coming, don't keep coming. Oh no, he's right there. 
I'm just here with the piggies. Don't mind me. No one back here but us pig physics. These shambling demons just... Just aren't making this easy for me. Okay, yeah, I won't look at it, Daniel, you poor, bless your little heart that can't handle it. Crystal clear, crystal clear. Couldn't get through any of these. Really just leaving us with the option of going towards storage. I don't know where that last guy went. Ourselves. This place is so big. Oh. Winding back around on myself, I see. Is he safe? Well, it's for his own daughter. Uh oh. He don't look so good. This man's naked! They put him in prison and he's naked? Hey! Anybody! Help! Christ! I don't believe this! Why? I mean, why? What did I do to deserve this? I mean, it can't be! Do I deserve this? It wasn't my fault! Why did he have to go in there? Don't go into burning houses! He should have known better. Hmm. Okay. So here we have another dungeon. And it's been indicated that this was some room of significance, and yet I can't make heads nor tails of, of why. Oh, can I dig this out? Can I hammer this out? Can I drill this out? No, no, and no. Third of August, 1839. I feel like I have fled the world and all its worries. Brennenberg is a majestic By the way, Hassan Pepperoni, thank you for resubscribing for 15 months. Well above even the I love you, man. Sorry trees. I've been around Following to Tomar's stream lately. Hey, no worries, Hassan Pepper. The impression of discovering it's something great having forgotten. you here. As if journeying with Marco Polo to the hidden Xanadu. <laughs> Alexander, the Baron, is a peculiar but gracious man. He seems well-versed in worldly matters and is not at all as eccentric as I assumed. My room is exquisite, and I'm confident that no hotel for miles could even hope to match it. 
As the sun sets on Brennenberg, its fairy tale varnish turns to an eerie gloom. Alexander's strange servants are never far away. They are a quiet lot, and their behavior could only be described as skulking. Alexander seems pleased by my presence. As he puts it, it seems like I got here just in time. Okay then. Man, it feels like we didn't find anything of significance down here, which makes me worry that I'm missing something. Oh, don't do that. Oh, don't do that now. Just gonna huddle in here with the naked man. Surely he wouldn't enter this room. Oh, come on. Oh, are you kidding me? Why? Oh, I don't like this. Don't come in. Don't come in. Pretty please. Don't come in. Uh, just a rat. You just heard the rat. You just heard the little rat. Probably shouldn't run. The nightmares woke me in the early morning. We're safe as long moment, as we're reading. I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlor. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me. And he answered that things can be done, but at a price. Oh God. He escaped? Where is he now? Oh, come on! Ooh, I got a glass jar. I think that's what I needed from storage. All right, we got our little glass jar. Now we just gotta... This padlock is in far too excellent condition for me to pick. Still in here? 
I do still want to check this room out. Just call it curiosity. Now we gotta follow the signs back to the Cocina. Kitchen, kitchen, where's the kitchen? Wandering around, looking for a kitchen. I think this is it. I think we've made it back to the kitchen. But I don't want to be disturbed again. Oh, I guess I, there is no door to close. Oh, come on. Is he really coming again? Back in with the piglies. Do we hear him? Has he returned? Oh boy. All right. Be very, very careful now. I'm gonna lean. I'm gonna lean. And I'll see shit, man. I'm trying to creep me out with this scary music. Okay, the glass jar holds the acid safely. So we now have acid. What to do with it, though? Ooh. Completely beyond me. Do we have any cool uh, mementos? No, of course not. No hints whatsoever. That's fine. That's just okay. All right, he's down there. He's like at the long, the far end. There, he just turned the corner to the right. There was a weak something, that's right. Presumably the acid could work with that. Find her. Can't use it on this. There was a weak lock somewhere, wasn't there? Let's hope we don't run into nothing spooky. Yeah, I wish I could say I remembered where I saw suspicious doors, but I don't. Don't remember a dang thing. down here. Alright. Nothing too special here, just a dang bed. Oh boy. <laughs> Where's a padlock when a guy wants to use acid? condition. The acid has severely weakened the padlock. Brilliant! 
Ah, oh, yes, the cistern, exactly where I wanted to go. All right. So you used the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. There's a lever. We won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Do I have a poison fungi in me now? Does this lower that ladder? Oh, it needs to be greased. Well, I have a cool glass jar. All I need is grease to put in it. Thank you, Lapinus, for resubscribing for seven months. This is the Tomar Victim Simulator? It's something like that. We came from here, right? The prison northern block. Okay. Nothing bad could be down. Oh, the water is too deep to traverse safely. So we need to pump that water out somehow, huh? Ooh. Looks like we already found our grease. Grease, 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 grease. Ooh, can I use this oil in my lantern? It's just not that kind of oil, I suppose. Ooh! Broken pipe blo blocking the ladder. Well, then why? It got somewhat damaged by the impact. Can't use that. Can't use that. It got damaged, you say? a brick at it a few more times. That's got to be the solution to this puzzle. All right. It won't budge. All right. This seems like a pretty localized puzzle. I'm just missing some... <laughs> Minor detail. Thank you, three-time tiger, for the 111 bits. And thank you, Turt Williamson, for being a new subscriber here on the subscriber verse. All right, three time tiger. Oh no, okay, I got that. If I were to jump up here and just grab the ladder, placing my entire body weight, no. Well, there's something that's going to break that pipe. So what's it going to be? We came from the prison. We got the cool brick. I was going to say, if I could jump on the pipe, you'd think my body weight would be enough. I can jump on the lever, but I don't think that's what they want me to do. So here's what I'm thinking. Three Time Tiger, by the way, think said th their message was in the Norm MacDonald voice. Hey, check it out. It's a shark. Can't really do a good Norm MacDonald, but that's, that's what you get. That's what you're going to get from me for now. Anything cool down here? Anything cooler than skewl?
And I know this is all watery over here, but did I miss anything? Any hidden stuff in the waters? Nope. What if I want more oil? There is no need to fill it again. Sire, thank you for that generous sub to Grease King 69. Do we have any mementos? Enter the sewer. It must first be drained. Now I'm getting desperate. It's got to be something obvious I'm missing. I know about the lever. Oh! I can just keep doing it. <laughs> Go figure. Uh -oh. Thirty-four minutes later. Does that one not work? Evidently not. Well, first of all, well, this room does open. The control room, if you will. With Algiers. Didn't you want to come? He wanted to, Daniel. But things <laughs> don't we always turn out the way we planned. The object of this game is, of course, to hit the chandelier with the chair, and everything else is just kind of achievement hunting. that up. Alright, and then the third one's a charm. And then, uh, we have three raised weights. Very cool. I don't know what that means. Came through here, right? Oh? No, we did not. Okay, so we don't want to go there unless we want to risk not being able to come back for a minute. It's stuck. Also stuck. Triple stuck. Is the height of these like a hint to what I'm supposed to do on the other side? Because if it is, that just, just seems annoying. But it would sure seem like that's exactly what it is. So what, the one on the left is like eye level? I hope I'm not 
overthinking this. Yeah, that's basically right. Okay, and then the one in the middle was... About level with no talent, Jesus. mediocre piece of shit. <laughs> Wild Woody, Wild Woody, Wild Woody. Uh. All right. So this is about level with that pipe there, which I assume is a similar means of comparison in here. Yeah, I'd say so. Yeah, so we're gonna call that just done. And then finally, the one on the right. The one on the right, a little lower, kind of in between the other two. Level with this pipe on the right, top of that to that, okay. So the way I see it, oh shit, is it also, am I doing this backwards? Because this one looks, crap. Let's give this a shot. I'm going to move this one up a tad. And move this one down a tad. Oh, that did it. What did that uh, accomplish exactly? I guess who's to say? This looks important, doesn't it? Like it would complete some pipe somewhere. <laughs> nice one, old dirty bastard. I did all that, but for what? Did that fix the pipe on the outside? You know what I'm in the mood for? Trapping myself behind this door. At least there's an equivalent thing on this side. Another dang puzzle. A wooden crank. A Holy fing sh! It's a gifting spree! I'm gonna pause for a second here. Jesus. <laughs> Sire, thank you so much for the 50. 50 gift subs, ladies and gentlemen. Sire is in a very generous mood. Thank you so much, Sire 3MK. That warms the cockles of my... Sorry, the cockles of my heart. There's a Freudian slip. <laughs> warms the cockles of my heart. And congratulations to all 50 of you who just got gift subs as well. Wowie, wow, wow, wowie, wow. Holy crap. Thank you so much, Sire. What a triumphant return by Sire. Thank you for making these streams worth streaming. Okay, all right. We need this. This is the most important tool so far. I'm just gonna light this up, save a little oil, since I've basically failed to do so up until this point. All right, that does that. And that does that. And that does that. And that does that. And is my effort to get this plug fully inserted into... Yep, looks like that's what the goal was. Listen. Daniel? Is that you? Damn, Daniel. What are you okay, doing? I shouldn't. I shouldn't reference shit like that. That's evil. That's a, that was a... I regretted that as soon as I said it. All 
I mean, this one is already correct. Holy fucking sh! It's a gifting spree! Are you kidding me? Dex the Swede coming in here with another gifting spree. We've got we've got another 10, 10 gift subs from Dex the Swede. Dex, you beautiful bastard. Thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. I hope you're doing well, Mr. Dex the Swede. Uh and I thank you, as always, for your bloody good service to the Oni Plays fandom, I mean. Let's see. The work I have put into this machine is unequaled by the reasoning of any man. The thought that generations of men have passed away since I first attempted to reconstruct the design is most tiring. The limitations of this world have made my work incredibly difficult. It has forced me to build the thing almost a hundred times larger than the delicate contraption it tries to emulate. Not to mention the flow of tamed lightning, crudely replaced by pressured steam pushing its way through pipes and turbines. It shames me to think of what the inventor would have thought of my monster. Where he works with a magnifying glass to carefully fix all the parts, I push five men to erect a tower of wrought iron in the hope that it will have even the tiniest hint of the power found in a traveler's locket. I see. But whatever that means, good luck to him. Surely these pipes I'm collecting are important. I refuse to acknowledge a reality where they aren't. Where I left the other one, though? Oh, here it is. I'll just sort of start a stack here. Anybody notice any missing pipe segments? Because I think I do. This is just like that time we had the cogs well cogs. Does that match that? Yeah, sure. Oh boy. Oh, come on. Oh god, where'd I just... Where'd the other one just go? Ah! Oh, drat on that box. Alright. There's one on the right. I don't... You'd think that I'm trying to match... The connections here. I guess, yeah, this would technically just be top to bottom, though, wouldn't it? But then I'm also supposed to connect these two, aren't I? So, still a little confused. Well, that's just not taking it. See, they're okay, they're all like slightly different lengths. So that does seem important. So we do still need that one. All right, I'm gonna put this bag here and that bag there. And let's go try to find some more dang pieces O pipe. No more laying pipe jokes now. That would just be inappropriate. I'm looking for some pipe. I'm looking for some pipe. I ho the hairy ho. I'm looking for some pipe. I wonder if 
I can climb up here and find the missing lengths of pipe within the pipes. Have we been down here? Is this the one I was just in? Up oh, and we're out of oil again. Lovely. Yeah, I know it's Hi Ho the Dario. I made up my own dang lyrics. Do, 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 do. Everything's always about steam and steam and oh look Here's like a longer variant God willing this is the last pipe I need So yeah, we need these connected and those connected and these get I might Am I thinking about this backwards? That should already be the solution. Because this connects to this, and this connects to this, and then the thing on the right. But is it supposed to be like directly across? So would this go on the left? Oh, sorry. Asymmetry strikes again. I think we've brought this baby to life. I, oh God. Uh, that wasn't supposed to happen. What's a dinosaur to do? When there's kids on the ice. Well, I can't pull these off. I'm a bit stuck. I don't have any oil. It is broken beyond repair. You're saying I can't. Oh, this cool wooden crank. Meaning I'm, oh no, okay. Yeah, I, I guess I could go back in there if I really wanted. And I don't. I guess we just go back to the cistern. I don't think there's anything left to do in the control room. All we know is steam. Steam is uh is going well. And I'm not talking about the video game purchasing platform. Oh cool, that fixed this. Was all that effort just for Oh uh, what? We'll need a push to dislodge. A push from what? Oh dear. Stuck on what? Harumph. All right. And Dylan, thank you for your lovely diff gift to Dex the Swede. Tomar bad at video game. That's not fair, Liv Hardman. Tomar not that bad at video game. But Tomar bad at conserving oil. Water from the spring. 
Yes, it enables me to control the water in the drain sewers to some extent. Also, it can be used for all sorts of purposes. Like the drinking? Eh, well, that too. But mostly to run different machines. Ah, like water mills. Exactly. Exactly. Like water mills. What does that mean? 7th of August, 1839. There is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even <laughs> I assumed I would have Three to time tiger. Be careful in the water, there might be sharks. Mind yeah, I bet. Life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon where he preferred to attempt his rituals. It turns out that Alexander is a true renaissance man, paralleled only by da Vinci, I'm sure. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research such as anatomy studies, alchemy and botany. The crown of Brennenburg must be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. What did I do? Seemed like I'm doing the right thing. Alright. We, we got some jugs. Water has begun to slowly fill the chamber. Okay. Don't be a wuss. Queets, thanks for the two dollar tip. Uh, love you, Tomar. I hope the Tom Manifesto is working out in your favor. I'm not much I can do from this side. Getting over here so I find a way to drop that drawbridge, I guess. Uh, you're my all-time favorite member of Oni Plays. Really enjoy everything you do. Keep it up, big guy. Also, has Jaxie had the baby yet? I'm afraid I've been a bit out of the loop. Yeah, the baby is uh, going to be nine weeks old on Thursday. So yes, Jaxie had the baby. I'm a proud father of a beautiful baby girl. Her name is Maya. Thank you for asking, Queets. Oh, don't hurt me with steam. Oh, don't hurt me with steam. Oh, did that shut off the steam valves? That's nice. Oh, come now. 8th of August, 1839. I could never be certain until today that I was on the right path. Using my orb, Alexander managed to channel its power unto us. The inner sanctum flared with blue, fiery light, and I could feel the same things I felt in the dark chamber in Algeria. It was like standing in a mad whirlpool of impressions. It was terrifying, but Alexander kept calm and wielded strange tools of science in order to tame the storm. Suddenly, the blue light was stained by strains of red, and the walls burst with pulsating tissue resonating with the scene. 
Alexander quickly covered the orb in some cloth, and the unspeakable thing vanished. Apparently, the orb's shadow is closer than Alexander thought. He said I should prepare for a warding ritual tomorrow. I'm not sure what he expects, but I have a bad feeling about this. A bad feeling. You've got a bad feeling, eh? And what's this? Redirect sewer water. Okay. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. There's just more of that water pouring in. I got a little scared. I'll admit it. I'll admit it. That hasn't been abundantly evident. I keep falling off this stupid thing. I'm just getting impatient now. Got the one down that way. Oh wait, has that drawbridge come down? Nope. Sure hasn't. What the heck's that connected to? I'd really like this. If I knew what the hell I was doing. This is the way back to the other part of the cistern. You're so much safer with that on. But yeah, what what is my end game here? Like I've already done this thing. Redirect sewer water, so we've done two of those. Is there a third? And if there is, it's probably past that drawbridge. So how the hell do I open the drawbridge? Hmm. Do we open a sewer gate? Asks Reuniclus X. Ah. Uh, I ain't never played this game before. Are you serious? <laughs> I guess that's on me for not trying it before. <laughs> Bay didn't quite spook me there, Barrel Wubba. But nice try. 
All right, here's the third grate. I guess it would have just kept looping that indefinitely until we got off the uh, that scroll. Did I just hear something scary? Did I just imagine that? kind of confused as to what I've been doing. There's no other areas to this place. I'm just going to get, get out of here and see if anything's changed in the other room. What was that? Was there meat in the water? Was there some of that man-eating meat? Nothing's changed in here whatsoever. And that thing's still stuck. Nope. No mementos. No cool items. Just pure, unadulterated disappointment. Oh, hey, did we drain that lower area, maybe? Oh, come on. You klutz. Barely conscious. What a wuss. Oh. <coughs> that did work. It's just full of horrible toxic gas. Great. So I can go down there, but I also can't go down there. Goodbye. Hello. <laughs> All right. So here's the thing. Finish that. Don't know how to push this. As far as I know, I drained stuff from here. You know what? When in doubt, let's chuck something at it. Let's... No! I should have taken the ladder. Damn it. Youch. I can't hold the brick and climb the ladder at the same time.
There we go. Let's get a little collection of bricks up here. I'm sure this won't work. But it's what I'm gonna need. Oh, I need to get the various suit. That's what it is, three time tiger. I'm just here too early in the game. Well, that didn't do shit. Oh gosh. What if I had put a really long stick on there so that when it falls, it smashes this thing? I mean, I don't think that's the solution, but I'm just trying to think outside the box here. It'll need a push to dislodge. It'll need a push to dislodge. This is a rather large area, don't you think? Uh, uh. Well, I tried. All right. It being 1030 and all, maybe this is a good time to take a quick little break from amnesia. And, uh, you know, take a save and exit. Just do the thing. I'm gonna get back to my family. Oh goodness, 8% of players have the pipe worker achievement and 9.6 the descendant achievement. We're already far further in the game than the average mortal. Or, or just not a lot of people have played this game since they added Steam achievements to it. <laughs> All right, with that, uh, I'm gonna turn off this stupid echo effect. And uh, with that, I think we're done with Amnesia for the time being. I do want to play some more, but I also want to play other stuff for this Octomar. So I hope you guys all have an excellent evening. And I will I try my best to see y'all Thursday. All right. Keep it classy, Tomar Streamo. And have a good night.